Chris Van Ellsberg was born on June 18, 1949 in Grand Rapids, Michigan. When he was born, his family lived in a farmhouse. His father ran a dairy with Chris's three uncles. When Chris was three, his family moved to a new house at the edge of Grand Rapids. His family moved once again when he was in the sixth grade. Chris went to high school in East Grand Rapids and never took an art class. Each year, an admissions officer from the University of Michigan came to his school to meet with students. While at a meeting with the admissions officer, he became an art student that day. Chris went to the University of Michigan in the fall of 1967. After finding his way, he decided to major in sculpture. He graduated in 1972 and went to Rhode Island for graduate school. Three years later, after earning his MFA degree, he set up a sculpture studio in Rhode Island. Soon after, he married Lisa Morrison. Lisa was a school teacher and suggested to her husband that he consider making illustrations for storybooks. With the encouragement of his editor, he began thinking about writing his own stories. In 1979, Chris wrote and illustrated his first book. Since that time, he has written and illustrated 19 books and has illustrated another three. In 1980, Chris was awarded the Caldecott Honor Medal for his first book, and he was also the winner of two more Caldecott Medals for Jumanji and the Polar Express. Jumanji was one of his best known books. For his designs in these books, he used a surreal surrealistic style. Most of them are almost real with touches of make-believe added in. For this, he used graphite pencils. The Polar Express is another one of his most famous books, which was later made into a movie. The illustrations in this book were done with oil pastels. This allowed Chris to blend and highlight to make the illustrations illustrations realistic or impressionistic. In 1991, Chris and his wife Lisa became parents to their daughter Sophia. Their second daughter Anna was born in 1995. Chris now lives in Beverly, Massachusetts on the north shore of Boston. I chose Chris Van Allsburg for this project because he not only wrote but illustrated one of my favorite books, The Polar Express. I love his illustrations and think that his work in the Polar Express and Jubanji is one of my favorites out of most children's books I've read. I think that by using the Polar Express in the classroom, students can learn descriptive language skills for their writing. One of the main things to take away from the book is that way Chris uses all of his senses when describing the boy's journey. The teacher can work with the students to incorporate senses and descriptive words in their writing. And also, both of these books were later turned into movies, which can also be used in the classroom with discretion.